Okay, are we ready? This is this is unreal. This is legit unreal. I never expected this game to be saved. For this game to come to the West officially. 15 years? I think it's 15 years after it originally came out. I was in college in Nagasaki when this game originally came out. This is a long time ago. <laughs> I have my new controller as well, unrelated to the game, but it's a, a nice pink controller. Playing it on Xbox, it just seems like a more safe, stable option on Xbox, because it is day one. Plus, isn't it awesome to just play it on Xbox again? I only played Fatal Frame 1 and 2 on Xbox back in the day, the original Xbox. <laughs> this is the one game where I was like, there is no way, this is never gonna get a Western release. It was tied between three different publishers. Everyone claimed that someone else had the publishing rights. It was lost forever. Until today. I'm gonna do normal. Uh, all three ghosts. They are visible right now. We'll do it a little brighter. Oh, this is crazy. I'm also... So, for anyone who doesn't know, I did a full translation of this game. Two, actually. I did one when I was starting out on YouTube, and then another uh, when, my, when I was a little bit better at translating. It's like a revised edition. I'm really curious how close it is to this official one. ね、美咲。本当にここに来ればよかったのかな。I never noticed her little necklace. I can't believe we're playing this. God. Beautiful, glorious white screen. Oh my god. Oh, press LB to strafe? Oh. She seems taller than I remember. Maybe because I used to stretch out the white screen. <laughs> photos lie scattered on top of the counter and then in the drawer. The photos have faded and are no longer recognizable. Oh my god. I am walking around with an actual controller. Not a Wii controller. The notice board is covered in old photos. Yeah. Rusted newspaper rack containing several ancient looking newspapers. The paper crumbles to the touch and the print is too faded to read. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> this is my second. I know. Okay. So I apologize if you're a long time watcher of my channel, then you've heard all of this before. I've played this game. I think I have four separate playthroughs of this game on my channel because I just keep playing it over and over again. A long-time fan, die-hard fan of this franchise. So happy we have this now on all consoles. Modern, updated graphics. We can only dream that someday we'll get this to... Um... Oh, there she goes. We can only dream that someday we get 1, 2, and 3 as well. How do I run? Oh, that's the menu. Pretty. <gasps> dolls. Zero dolls. Perform a quick turn. Oh. Nice. Um, 
This should be locked. There you go. <sighs> I think I'll keep it spoiler free. Even though we literally played this again last year. We stuck his flashlight on the floor. Okay. It's not Misaki's. There she goes. Misaki. Misaki. Can I read the sign? No. It's the Aso Museum. Locked from the inside, Misaki. I like that they kept that in Japanese. 2F nurse station. Okay. Um, can I go through here for that? Dude, it looks so good. Um, every now and then a gameplay trailer would come out and Sean would be like, does it really look that much better than it did on the Wii? And I was like, dude, hold on. I'll grab my playthrough and show him. And he was like, oh, Jesus. <laughs> it looks so good. I'm so happy. He's a ghost. I wonder if it's exactly the same or if they changed some sections up, you know? If they made some tweaks here and there. We'll find out. God. Beautiful. There might be an... I don't... Ooh, I heard a door. No, not yet. Ah, uh, that's locked. Ooh, pretty light here. There she goes. A nurse for the nurse station? familiar door sounds. I still hear those door sounds in a movie every now and then, and then I'm always like, Fiddle frame! <laughs> There's also a really distinctive creak door. Ooh, there she is. That I always tie to these games. You... no one here. You can examine the various objects found in your environment. Objects that can be examined will glimmer. Yeah, so we need to look over them to actually have them appear. And then a grab animation. Reach out with your hand to examine it. Stand next to the object and the icon will be displayed in the corner of the screen. Press and hold to reach out. I wonder if there's ghost hands. Oh my god. The fact that this is all in English now is such a blessing. I've put the key to the museum on top of my desk. There are a lot of irreplaceable objects in the museum, so please take care to keep the door locked at all times. Yeah, and that blue little indicator 
on the bottom right that you just saw is the item indicator as well. Or pictures. E. This is the key for the room Isaki went into. But we don't have um menu screen. We don't have a camera yet. From here you can view the map, items, and view records. Okay. Also press start to open the map directly. Oh cool. It's gonna show me where the key goes. Yep. Um there's a blue here. Nurses' uniforms and other items are scattered around this inside the display case. There's definitely something here. Oh, it's a doll! I can't take a picture of you yet. Okay. Guess I'll leave that for what it is. Music time. Still sounds just as grating. <laughs> Good job. I was wondering if they cleaned up the audio at all, or uh, it's supposed to sound like this. Like it's supposed to sound awful. <laughs> That is a creepy close-up. Go, 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 go! Okay. Because it sounds exactly like I remember. But it does sound cleaner, and I don't know if it's just my imagination. Because the game looks cleaner, maybe I'm imagining that it sounds cleaner? I don't know. I wonder if they cleaned up the soundtrack at all. Or all the voices. I'm so happy. <laughs> it looks so good. My little baby. All grown up and out in the west. I saw a review that said that... Um, that... Their main complaint was that the characters move too slow. I'm like, oh boy, you've never played Fatal Frame, have you? <laughs> or, or you've only played five. I remember when this game came out and we were like, oh, they're pretty quick. They can run. <laughs> uh, yes, we have arrived. <laughs> yes. That was very in my ears. Seeing so much detail now. Aso Chang! Can I look at the portrait? So, this is the Aso Museum. Um, I think it was Aso Kunihiko who invented the camera. Can I read this? You can kind of read it, Meiji, and then they blocked out the years. Aso Kunihiko Senshi? Hakushi? Professor? Ga Ryugetsu-do, Ryugetsu Island, o Chosa Kenkyu o... Kenkyu sareta? Toki ni shio sareta. So... This museum is dedicated to Aso Kunihiko when he visited us in some 
obscured year. Um, and these are the tools and stuff that he used while he was here for research. That's what I just read. Old portrait hangs on the wall. The plaque reads, Kunihiko Aso, yeah! <laughs> he must be the man in the picture. This is the man himself. This is God in Fatal Frame, okay? <laughs> God invented the camera. Books. Worn books line the glass case. Dampness has caused the print to run, making them illegible. Oops. <laughs> Professor Aso's notes. Oh, here we go. Let's see. Those with spiritual potential can see shadows, forms invisible to the average person. The souls of the dead, veg vestiges of thoughts left behind in a place. My camera obscura was created to capture these clues of, to the spirit world, and I now have a chance to improve its capabilities even further. In the course of my research here, I have discovered that the materials used in mask making on Rogetsu Isle can improve the camera obscura's ability to capture those shadowy forms on film. I have also come to believe that the Camera Obscura holds a power greater than even I had ever expected. This is the power of the Camera Obscura, to affect these shadows when photo ph photographing them. <laughs> it is something like the exorcism that those with spiritual potential refer to. It is my experiments on this island that have brought me to this bold conviction. I have decided to donate a Camera Obscura to the owner of the hotel. I did not explain why I was donating it, but... I cannot help but feel that there will come a day when this island will need the power of a camera obscura. I only hope that I am wrong and that such a day will never come. <sighs> I can't help myself. I, I promise I won't do this for every text, but I remember this text. Okay. So my translation reads, I gave one of my cameras to the owner of the place I'm staying without explaining what it can do. I have to consider that this camera's powers might be necessary here someday. I hope my fears are unwarranted. Ah, isn't that interesting? The place I'm staying, they just said the owner of the hotel, without explaining what it can do. I did not explain why I was donating it. I have to consider that this camera's powers might be necessary here someday. I cannot help but feel that there will come a day when this island will need the power of the camera obscura. I hope my fears are unwarranted. I only hope that I am wrong and that such a day will never come. That's so interesting because it's like, it kind of means the same thing, but we chose a very different wording. Ah, oh, I like that. <laughs> Oh, it's so excited. It's wriggling. Oh, what a beautiful camera. This must be Professor Aso's camera obscura. Here we go. Ooh. Okay, give me the lowdown. When a wraith appears, you can seal it away by taking photos. Press Y to take out the camera. Press R, right trigger to take a photo. Okay. Press and hold L while aiming to lock on. Oh, thank God. Okay. Okay, camera, lock, picture. Nice! That was creepy. That was so much detail in her. Was that a person? Can we take a picture of the doll? Yeah. Oh my god, it's the same! Yes! That makes me happy. Hozuki dolls. These dolls in red kimono are called Hozuki, Hozuki dolls and are a tradition on Dogets Islands. Uh, their origin is not known for certain, but they are said by some to have originated as dolls made by parents in memory of their deceased children. 
On some islands in the area, the dolls are said to be unlucky, but here on Dogetsu Island, they are placed in various different locations in order to ward off evil spirits. I think they're evil, honestly. Storm of cameras, they all seem rather antiquated. Antiquated? Antiquated? Can we read this? Old scraps of newspaper pinned up. They're mostly illegible, but Professor Aso can be made out in places. Oh, I can see a face on the door. Do you see that? I have never seen that before. Was that in the original? There's definitely a mask face on the door. Okay, let's go. Let's get out of here. That's a big hand. Damn. Ooh, she's so creepy. Hey, is that painter dude? Poor girl. Oh, prologue. Oh my god. Here we go. Oh, I'm so excited. So excited. Safe, baby. Okay. Um, yes. Close the menu. I'm gonna go do the first chapter and then call it there. さんさえしないことにはそんな私には小さい頃の記憶がない。私がいた島のこと。Goosebumps! Oh my god. Oh, she even has some bit of skin texture on her cheeks. Logetsu. <laughs> あれが同月と。二人の友達が死んだ。マリエと友恵。そこ。神隠しにあったうちの二人。窓川、三崎と島に行くと私に告げ。戻ってない。あの島へは近寄らないで。マーン。お母さん、知らない方がいいことがあるの。でも私は確かめたい。あの時何があったのか。そして失った記憶の先に何があるの。Beautiful. It looks so cool. <sighs> yes. Phase one. Ah, uh, that makes sense. They call it phases of the moon. I, um... I was watching the developer updates 
And apparently her outfit is inspired by piano recital outfits that they wear in Japan, I'm assuming? I hadn't really heard of piano recital outfits, uh, but apparently her outfit is inspired by that. Uh, RBX to start snap mode. If you find an interesting location, try taking a picture. Here you can freely- <gasps> Photo mode? No! Oh my god, that's amazing! Dude. What? Wow. Aperture. Noise off. Oh, that's so much better. <laughs> wow. High saturation. High contrast. Shocking. Oh, that's creepy. <laughs> oh, oh, that's the girl from Fatal Frame 1! No, don't tell me. That means they know. Do you think they're working on Fatal Frame 1? That's legit the girl from Fatal Frame 1. Ah, oh, there she is in all her glory. Awesome. Okay. God, that's amazing. That was very detailed. I'm surprised how detailed everything is. I know it's it's a remake. I'll get over it. <laughs> We're seeing so much more. I know this place somehow. The clock with the phases of the moon. Tall grandfather clock. Instead of numerals, the face show phases of the moon. Um let's see. I don't think I'm supposed to go here, actually. I should just go upstairs. Oh, everything is so pretty. Phone? No. I think we're supposed to try and open this up. Oh, there you go. The notes to put in bars. Scrap of paper with writing on it. Looks like Madoka's. A dull pain has laid heavy in my heart ever since I laid eyes on Doget's Isle looming ahead of us. Why does the mere sight of the island make it so difficult for me to breathe when I don't remember anything about the time I spent there? Misaki could be right. There might just be something here. When she suddenly told me she was going to Doget's Island, I followed her out of concern. Misaki was so determined to come here, I was frightening. It was frightening. She still won't tell me what this is all about. The island is getting closer now. Misaki is looking at it coldly, as though her gaze were the only thing pinning it to the horizon, the only thing keeping it from slipping away in the night. With Marie and Tomo Tomoe already gone, I couldn't bear lose to lose Misaki as well. Korewa? Two friends. Oh, you can even see details in her stocking. Yeah, there. Wow. That's detail. Let's save. The game will automatic will save automatically when you go near a glow. <gasps> oh. A message will appear on screen when the game is saving. Seriously? <gasps> that is so convenient. Okay, costumes. Oh, there's so many. There's so many. Oh, that's cute. I like that one. PJs. I can't wait to get her... Um, Yukata outfit. At least I hope. Oh, she can wear a mask. At least I hope that... Um... I unlocked those. I hope they kept those outfits in. There's these beautiful yukatas or kimonos. I think it's yukatas. Um, that you can unlock after beating the game. No, you don't want to go in there. Is there? Wasn't there? Oh, I don't have a camera. What am I doing? 
I'm remembering a doll, but can't even take a picture right now, so. Also a museum. Madoka might be in this room. I think it's gonna be blocked off. Yeah. You don't want it? There was once a great disaster on this island which almost destroyed it and caused Doget's isle, isle, isle to become feared as a place close to the underworld. However, it has recovered from that disaster and is no longer closed off to people from outside of Doget's islands. As an outsider, I had anticipated resistance to my visitation. To my surprise, the chief welcomed me gladly to the island, seeming in the hope, seemingly in the hope that I would help introduce its native cultures such as the Kagura festival and traditional Rogets engravings and craftsmanship to the outside world. I came to Rogets Isle to look for materials for my camera obscura because of the unique indigenous culture, the folklore of which is based upon the moon. In that folklore, the sun represents the outer form of things and the moon the inner. The moon therefore re represents memory, personality, and the soul. Believing that the soul is still connected to the underworld after the body dies, they say that the moon is a symbol of that world, as well as a gateway into it. They have a Kagura festival where the souls of the dead return to this world, and the most important element of that festival is the mask worn by the participants. The mask worn by the maiden during the Kagura is the point of contact between the living world and the world of the dead, the underworld, represented by the moon. A mask that connects the, to the underworld. There are many kind, kinds of masks on this island, and I hope to greatly advance my paranormal research by investigating them all. Nice. Mass disappearances on the island. At approximately 4.30 p.m. yesterday, the captain of the Oboru Maru, docked at Rogets, Rogets Isle, reported the deaths of multiple Rogets Islanders. All of the bodies were found with their hands covering their faces, leading the police to fear an outbreak of some kind of infectious disease. No survivors found. The police plan to continue the search for those in islanders whose whereabouts have yet to be determined while recovering the bodies. Despite everyone on the island being either missing or dead, there were no signs of any conflict or foul play. Faced with nothing to go on but the sudden appearance, disappearance of the island's population, and without any evidence of natural disasters, the police remain baffled by this bizarre incident. I knew we could read something here. Old newspaper about Aso's visit to the building from the time the museum was established. Mainland scientist Professor Kunihiko Aso has arrived on Dogetsu Isle. The professor, having deep knowledge of folklore studies, wishes to study the legends, the legends and traditions of our island. He will also be present to observe the Dogetsu Kagura to be held tomorrow. Hopefully this will lead to many more visitors coming to us from the mainland. Also, it has been announced that the room where the professor is staying at Dogetsu Hall will be made into a museum in his honor. So this was the room he was staying in. Okay, so there we go. It's like, pick me up! How do I get your attention? Jeez. <laughs> oh, Madoka's handwriting. Misaki and I are making our way towards Dogetsu Hall. The dizziness I felt on the way here has only gotten worse since we arrived on Dogetsu Isle. The air here is deathly still. It feels so hard to breathe. There is something about the smell of this place. I have had memories rekindled by certain smells and music before. Like when I heard the tune Duka wrote. I remember things, but not clearly. Sensations of textures, bursts of pain. Fake things that can't be expressed in words, but this time it's different. I feel a dark mass rising up inside my body. It's going to penetrate my head. We should have waited for Duca.
<laughs> Filament, oh yeah. Red in the presence of race, yellow if the ghosts are specters. When other forces are present, blue. Huh. I don't really remember yellow. Oh, and that's just for items. Oh, gotcha. Uh, that wasn't correct, apparently. There we go. Take a photo. Okay. Ah, now it's blue. Oh. Yes. Something has appeared in the photo. It shows five masks hanging on the wall. You got it. I'll go find those. Oh, you can actually see through the glass. Huh. Like, I mean, I could actually see into the hallway. Before the cutscene. Take your picture. Okay. Can I? I need to run. Oh god, she's ahead of me. Okay, I have a little bit more space here. Oh! <laughs> it's so much harder now. I don't know the controls. There. That should do it. That made me stress a little bit. I was suddenly like confusing the joysticks and the buttons. <laughs> Still a warm up. Oh. These are in the art book as well. How they updated the masks. That's a creepy one. Oh, item? Wasn't there an item in one of the masks? It's harder to look around now that it's not the Wii mode, actually. Hmm. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I didn't even see it. Spirit stones. Okay, so they kept that. So these are for upgrades. But I don't think I can do that yet. Uh, this button. Yeah, five at least. Okay. Are there like items here? Yeah, that's what I want. Found a pamphlet. Dogetsu Kagura is by far the most important traditional festival on Dogetsu Isle. It is held only once every 10 years. The highlight of the festival is the Kagura itself, taking place in the Temple of the Lunar Eclipse, a maiden known as the Vessel, and five girls known as Organs prefer perform a sacred dance. Why not use the Kagura as a chance to visit Dogat's Isle and experience its rich history? <gasps> ah, there we go. Healing item. Anything else? Yes, film! 14! Um, if you really have never seen any Fatal Frame before, um, 
the film goes 7, 14, what is it, 36, 64 um, in increments. Uh, and then there's also 90 and 0. 0 is the absolute strongest. I'm always a bit confused about the numbers because they changed it after Fatal Frame 1, I think. Can I go in here? No. So if I just hover around here... Oh, it's safe. I don't know if it saves that quickly though. Maybe you need to hover around it for a bit longer. So many little improvements that make so much sense. Oh yeah, here, the doll. I think it's like... Oh, wrong button. I don't know, I don't, you can't see it like this, but I think you're supposed to see it like peeking out from between the, there it is. There, you see. So sneaky. I don't remember all of them. There's 99, I think. Um, I just remember a couple, but. I usually end the game on like 40, 50, I think. If I don't use a guide. I've also never gotten 99 because there's a bug. Or there's one that you can't capture. <laughs> hey, I did it! My first running one. Thousand points, baby! <laughs> You might come across specters during your exploration. If you succeed in taking pictures of them, they'll be added to the ghost list. Yeah. Oh wait, so can I? Let me test it. I think it just saves that quick. Are those the opening hours? Oh, can't check it. Oh my god. It looks so good. That looks so good. Is Creepy Man here? Yoo-hoo. You think he's here? I think he's here. Creepy man! So creepy, man in kitchen. So creepy. Kitchen behind the counter. Okay. Let's see where we can find some items. Shine our light everywhere. There's two over here. I need to write something. Doesn't matter what. Got to keep writing or I'll disappear. If I stop writing, I lose it all. Slip and fall. Gotta keep writing. It's no good. I don't know. It's all over. It's getting closer. Melting. Mom, help me. Stop it, all of you. Stop shaking me like I'm a toy. Oh, so I did get some decorating. Is there still a doll like in or under the piano? I seem to remember. Hmm. Okay, guess not. I was wrong. Thought there was something on the right. Ooh, lens! Lenses can be equipped on the camera obscura or spirit stone flashlight and have a variety of effects. Let's see what this effect is. Uh, press X, spirit points, right. 
Okay. Right on the D-pad to change them. Oh my god, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Sorry. I need to get used to these. Lens. Equipped. Blast. Take a more powerful shot when used. Okay. I didn't catch how to actually... Mm. Lenses. Press X. Oh, okay. If you have enough spirit points. Gotcha. Oh. Oh. Nurse who misplaced key. Ooh. Hi. Okay, bye. I was just heading over here. Because... <laughs> A little sneaky doll in the fireplace! What is you guys' game where it's like, if I ever get a remake, a re-release of this game, like, I will die happy, because this is mine. Like, I'm done. This is the one re-release where I was like, it's never gonna happen. I can dream. Ooh, now we can die. Free revive. I can dream, but it's never gonna happen, you know? Ah, that's where I tried to go. Gotcha. Plaque with something 23. I'm telling you. Ah, oh, 13? Ah, I thought it was 23. I think the other one's 23. Ah, I was trying to impress you guys. Messed it up. Activate the switch on the panel in the storeroom under the entrance hall stairs. Oh, that's for the gate. Yeah, sure the number total up to 13. There's more. Yeah, more items here, I think. <gasps> they didn't give us a thing for that yet, right? Oh, I got scared again. So what you just saw was a ghost hand coming in. Um, I don't know if they changed it. So in the original four, if that ghost hand grabs your wrist, uh, you lose the item permanently. That's on the floor that you're trying to grab. Um, so they changed it then for five that you can still get grabbed, but you won't lose the item. So I'm really hoping that this game is the same, but we'll have to play and find out if we actually accidentally get grabbed here and there, you know? Okay, I think I got most of it. The wall is lined with masks like the ones that appeared in the photo. Wait, is one of the masks missing? So... Hmm? Ah! Yes! I got him! Damn, I had to correct a lot. <laughs> to get him in shot, in frame. Fatal frame. Thank you! Big breach. Anything here? Okay, we have now come full circle, so I will turn and head back. Now that this one is remade, I think the next game where I would be like, I will die if they make a remake, it would be Fatal Frame 1. But at the same time, the game is so dear to me that it would also be stressful because I'd be so worried that they change it to a degree where I'm, I don't like it anymore. But yeah, that would be another one where I'm like, oh my god, yes. Even if it's like the same, like not even a remaster or a remake, but just like, just a re-release, like a port. Just put it on everything that is available. I'd be so happy. Other than that, honestly, most of my favorite older games are available on modern consoles, so. I don't see him, but I got him. 
Oh, there you are. Oh, his face is all messed up. Isn't there a letter here? Hmm, I thought so. Yeah, there you go. Another newspaper article. Last dog gets the survivor dies. This morning at 10 a.m., the last remaining survivor of the mass disappearance incident on Dogat's Isle died in the hospital. The irreversible physical and mental trauma she sustained have been identified as probable causes of death. Oh. I thought it was going to be longer. And we're out. Also, isn't this Tori amazing? Beautiful details. So imposing. Look at those details. Now we can actually see them. Oh. I got him! Boy standing beyond gate. Um... Let me actually check, because we could turn off film grain in the photo mode, so I was like, uh, can we? But no. Dude, that quick save is going to save us so much time. <laughs> you just run by it. It's so nice. Are you going to wiggle for me? Dogat's investigation stalls. Two weeks into the investigation, there is still no sign of the missing Dogat's Islanders. Investigators have expressed fears that the case will be closed on this mass disappearance incident due to a complete lack of leads to follow. Many bodies were found with their hands covering their faces, expressions leading investigators to suspect a connection between the appearance of these bodies and their cause of death. While the cause has yet to be determined, the possibility of an outbreak of infectious disease has apparently been ruled out. <laughs> wiggle wiggle! Okay, 13. I never actually remember. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. There's rope hanging from the ceiling? Oh, look at this bird! Wow, you can see so much detail now. I think there is a doll here. Yeah. <laughs> No item though? Hmm, guess not. There's no filament, so. I think it basically means that almost every room in the house has a doll somewhere. Oh! I was just gonna look behind the counter. God, we can finally hear those clearly because we don't have to listen through the Wiimote anymore from the speaker. I don't... I can't remember a doll. Oh. Okay. Curiosity satiated. Time to go up the stairs. I feel like I just need to treat it like every room in the game has one doll. At least one doll. So. Oh. Go 
I get them both? Nurse with patience. Must be. Yeah. Okay. Is this a window? Mm, it's boarded up. Oh, item. It's this bench. This is always a bit... Ah! It appeared immediately! That one's always tricky on the Wii. <laughs> oh, red ones. Nice. Those are for lenses. Blue camera upgrade. Did you just lock it? Oh, never mind. You? It's good to be back. You gotta wait for them to disappear, you know? You never know what they're gonna do. Madoka! Don't look at the face. If you look at the face, you lose it all. Slip and fall. Can't see my face. Just like the other two. Nice. So the points we get from fighting and taking pictures, uh, we can use to exchange for film. So if we ever need more strong film or we run out of film, we can exchange that. Ooh, sacred water. Nice. Isn't this one? Maybe later. Oh, here we go. <sighs> Little hoarder boy. Got so many things. This room is full of all kinds of strange things taken from around the building. Okay, there's tons of items here. I just need to have them all show up. Isn't there... Yeah, there's a doll in the plant. An old tape. <gasps> yes. Creepy. Like, don't like it. Uh, not that button. This button. Where do I listen to records? Voices? Tape. Tape, Tape, どうですか気分の方は。わかりません。気がつくと廊下に行って月が見えて月を見ると少し落ち着くんです。いつからですか？前の祭りの後からです。祭りが終わってもまだ。あの感覚が続いているような。それはどういう？どんどん自分が溶けて亡くなって何か忘れてはならないことがあったのに。うん。うん。何かを忘れたことも思い出せなくなっているような気がするんです。そうか。まずこの薬を。
あの音楽を聞くたびにまたやめてくださいやめてわかりましたあなたには特別な治療をしましょう Damn. He's up to no good.、Um, where's the next item? Here. Boy's Diary. April 6th, rainy day. I found another thing to keep for myself today. It's a mask from the dinner hall. They always take me away when I'm not looking. I did. No, I don't like it. I have to get the pieces back again. I put the mask I found today under the bed so no one can find it. No one will take it from me this time. If they do, I'll get them. Well, tough luck, kid, because I'm going to get it. <laughs> oh, look at the shiny eyes! When a wraith attacks, you have a chance of capturing a fatal frame. I thought I needed a lens for that. If you time it correctly, you'll take a fatal frame, which grants bonus effects. Okay. Equip the alarm upgrade. There you go. Fatal frame icon at the top will start flashing. Yeah. I don't think I have to get it. He's so detailed. Oh. That was weird. Whoa! Came too close. <gasps> He bloomed. <laughs> Just kill. This isn't right. Someone took it. If I don't hurry, I'll start disappearing. Who did it? Give it back. Give it back. Give it back. Disappearing. There's still more items. There it is. Looks like the mask in the dining hall. Should be the missing one. That's all the items. I should maybe heal. I've gotten hit a couple times. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I really need that alarm upgrade, but I haven't found it yet, I think. It's not a lens, if I remember correctly. Five, seven. Uh, let's check the end of the hall here. Great. <laughs> There we go. Equipment upgrades can be equipped on your camera screen. Yeah, okay. This will be very handy. Now we'll get like a little ding 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 when it's the perfect moment to strike. Equipment upgrades. Equipped. Okay. That is it, right? Alarm. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Got any dolls around here? Not that I can see. I 
Probably one somewhere. Um, still not blue. Okay. Ooh, red. Uh, let's see if we can get the alarm. There. Immediately, I do so much better. <laughs> I'm so trained for that sound. Yeah, it's like a ping. Let's see if there's a doll in here. The nurse is station. Gotta be a little bit nosy, right? There's probably. Oh, I got that one already. No, I didn't. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, a new item. I don't see any other dolls. And we got one, so... That's probably good for this room, then. I think one a room is like a good policy. We'll probably get pretty far with that. Okay, so we got the mask. We just have to drop it off back in the cafeteria. Man pressing against the window. Hello, man. Goodbye, man. I think there's some really sneaky ones as well where it's like you have to look through a window outside and then it's like outside on the floor or something. There's some really sneaky ones like that. Ta-da! Seal on the door in a museum has been broken. Awesome! Look at the little details and the frills on our shoulders. It's this way. Like when you get her really close to the wall. I can't really see the details. So cool. <laughs> Making myself paranoid now being like, is there a doll out through the window? I think so, somewhere. But I don't think it's here. I think it's, um... Well, it's a section I can't really get into yet. Turn around. Don't come any closer. There we go. Yeah. Special chance. FaceTime kill. <laughs> so it wasn't the painter guy, actually, in that first cutscene where I was like, painter guy? It was that guy. That's not painter guy. Should go through here, and then we can finally open the door where we saw our friend. <laughs> it's open. I wonder if 
this room still has a frame rate, dude. Whenever a fight occurs in this room, there is like a... Some of the books can fall off the shelves. And it's... It causes the frame rate to tank a little bit. Maybe I should put the 14 film on. Maybe it's time. Actually, can't we do that from here? Oh yeah. Awesome. Okay, any more items? An array of masks portraying a range of expressions, each with a nameplate. They must be the names of the people who made them. There she is! <laughs> oh god. Creepy. great she came very close <laughs> that's it chapter one phase one done should be able to get a manual save in now. Oh god. Amazing. It looks perfect. I couldn't ask for anything more. Um, some of these I'll do by chapter. I might make them longer towards the end of the game. I think they will be longer. I think um, the chapters will get longer and longer. I think from last time I played it, like the last episodes will be like two hours each-ish. But for these, I think it'll be nice to do it per chapter. For me, it'll be nice as well to do. <laughs> I say shorter recordings, which is still almost an hour ten-ish, I think, this one. I know I'm talking a lot, I just can't really help it. I'm so excited and I've played this game so many times and I love it to death. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you guys enjoy the look of the game as much as I do and are here for the journey to see the new version in all its glory. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed that. And I'll see you guys soon for phase two.